Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today I'm doing another version of Jeep Plays All the Games, this time with the Indie Speedrun 3.0. This is the third annual Indie Speedrun. All these games remain 48 hours. I don't know if there was a theme or anything. Nothing was listed. But I'll be playing each one for about a minute. There's 140 entries, about 10 games per video. Link to the individual games in the description so you can check them out. And all my info will also be in the description so you can check me out. Feel free to like, comment with your favorite, and subscribe. And at the end of this, I'll probably have some sort of article on, of my favorites up on Fireside. As always, thank you very much for watching. Next. We're playing the game Swing Me to the Moon. Oh. Alright, we got this. Magical. Oh, grab it. No. Now fall and break her legs. Oh, wait, she fell on a little. Oh, we said stamina. Feels if you stand on increase slightly, carry on. Alright. Found a little sandbox, that's okay. This is pretty cool. Alright, guys, we want to get to the moon. We go back. Ugh, that was kind of a fail. I ended up using too much stamina and, like, rolled around. I think she's saying Pika. Anyway. Let's try again. I like this idea. Oop. Come on. No, see, we just don't make it. I suck at this. It's probably way easier than making it look. Next. Playing Noodle Rumble. Click to move around, grab, take out for 10 robins. Regular customer rumble, chef, throw, not chef throwing knife, farmers increase ramen production income. I'm not going to remember any of these, probably. Chefs, make a ramen. Three. How many of these guys? A couple of disposable soldiers. I like how occasionally I throw stuff. Playing Yeti, get yourself together, get your axe, press space, and run. There we go, oh, whatever. Alright, so this game did say unfinished, like over and over and over again. Uh, I shoot you. Oh, I can make trees fall. Can I click? Ah, oh, shit. There we go. You're trapped, Bigfoot. You're trapped. I win. You lose. I don't quite understand how I'm not here over these trees or anything, but you know. Next. We're playing Carnado. Do you want to get promoted, follow the arrows, and pick up that car? Alright. So I can hold this driver. Car. No truck? Uh, good. Drive first. Plenty of wasting points. Holy fuck! I wasn't even in the road. Oh, well, that's how we get promotions, huh? Because there's all of these cars now to lift. No idea if I'm doing this game right. Oh, 
Now bring it back. Hurry. I don't even know where I was. Close enough? No, I just hit some stuff. It's a bit laggy for me. Ah, oh, shit. Yay, yeah, you in panic, press R to reset your position. No! Get this car in here. Not bad, to get another one. Next, we're playing Plant Life. Some more roots so I can get more water. Oh, don't have enough for that. Enough water for you, 40 and 40. Yep. Need. So you just like let glucose and water build up so that we can grow a bit better. Nope, not yet. This is a cute little happy plant. Some ants coming. Nope. Produce more. What? What? Ants, stop it! I don't even know how to stop them, really. Come on, water. We need to update this water thing. Oh, we can shake him. Shake us. I'm like rapidly clicking, hoping it'll somehow help. Oh, no. Need more water. Shake off this ant. It's not a fun ant. He needs to stop eating you. Really need more water so painstakingly slow. Yay. There we go. Ask for water. This will be soon. There we go. I will wait a little bit more. Go away, ants. Poor flower. Just wants to live its life. Next. We're playing Ice and Simple. Alright. So if that bounces to that, I kind of need to go back. That'll, that'll do. Just clicking on the signs to rotate them. Oh, I kind of thought that was going to take him the other way. Alright. There we go. Yay, he made it home. I right, probably want him to go up. That way. That way. And down. Alright. Beautiful. The little penguin. This is cute. Alright, hold on. Let me bounce that way. Alright, let's probably bounce him that way. We should probably bounce him up. Probably, that's probably it. Ah, he was the wrong way. Oh, there we go. Sorry about that penguin. That should bring you home. I like how there's all these other, like, Signs as well, so there's more than one answer, I bet you, to this riddle. Alright. I totally didn't even do the signs after this little jump. I just wanna see the jump. This is pretty neat. Next. I'm playing Book of Beasts. Alright, click to attack, arrows to pan view, B to open and close book. Level 1 of 8. Alright, made of peace. Alright, this is a rock. It's boring, it's rubbish, being a pet it has psychic powers. Alright. Oh, I'm a rock. Totally a rock. I just squished a fox. In which Dwayne encounters the lesser womps. But I've now crushed him, so. Move that tunnel. Let's be. Okay. Pet rock. I'm playing. I'm boring. What do I do? I can just kind of hop over. Now let's pan around. Come on, come to this side like you did before. Oh, 
I have to click on this guy, actually. I keep trying to click elsewhere, but I just need to click on a fox. This is neat. I really like the graphics. Not a lot of challenge to it, though. Good job, Rock. Next. We're playing Audi in an otter operation. Alright, there we go. Totally said that correctly without at all. There we go. Alright, so I'm an otter. Probably go through there. Don't worry, he'll probably never notice me. Ah, except. Take that. Sorry. Sorry, otter, I failed you. Just kidding, game didn't freeze. Just froze for like 10 seconds. <laughs> Get out of here. Our otters seems to have a long, like, loading time almost. Loading time, if you will. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna get out of here. As soon as I turned the corner, he was like, eh. Nah. Don't really care no more. Well, that was close. This level is quite bigger than the last one. Oh, I found it. We're playing Rising Flame. Mommy? Daddy? Alright, baby. Right here. Yummy. Yeah. Eat tons. I feel kind of bad. Why is that little flame? Will we poke you? It tickles. Alright. What's this do? I feel better now. Okay. Already you feel kind of bad? I mean, I just brushed it, didn't I? Make sure you're very well brushed, right? <laughs> Poke it a ton. Poke it everywhere. feel kind of bad after eating one log. I'm just gonna feed you more. This is a pretty cute game though. I'm supposed to go like this. Brush off everything. And then poke you. Uh, poke, poke, poke. Shouldn't tickle. It's pretty sharp actually. <laughs> Next. Next we're gonna talk about the game Halloween. It's a real life game with two to four players ages 12 and up between one to two hours of gameplay. Shuffle the welcome mat cards together, but keep the muffin cards in a separate pile and put together the board as the instructions state. Each player chooses a character and places them on start. Roll the dice to see who goes first. Play with the highest number goes first, the next highest second. Play players enter the zone. End zone gain points in the following order. After the third player finishes the game, and in all players tie up the points. This is like a trick or treating Halloween based game. I guess, and there's some pictures, it's just a bunch of pictures and words, so it's like a real life game and you're gonna have to get these like candy cards and Halloween muffin cards. It looks pretty neat for a Halloween themed party. Uh, zombies get, what What gets you past? Zombies take black licorice, werewolves take peppermints, vampires take cherry juice chews, demon portals take caramel popcorn balls, and landmines take candy corn. So if you want like a Halloween themed game, this is adorable and should probably be played at your next Halloween party. Next.